Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. In a bid to modernize its military capabilities, France is embarking on a quest for a successor to its aging LRU-M270 Multiple Launch Rocket System, MLRS. This endeavor, as reported by La Lettre on May 13, 2024, comes as part of a broader effort to enhance the nation's long-range strike capabilities. With the Directorate General of Armaments, DGA, issuing a call for tenders, major players in the defense industry are vying to secure the lucrative contract. Thales, a prominent defense contractor, has forged an alliance with Ariane Group to propose an innovative long-range artillery solution. This strategic partnership aims to address the evolving requirements outlined by General Pierre Schill, Chief of Staff of the Army, during a session of the National Assembly's Defense Committee in November. The new system must surpass the capabilities of the existing LRU units, extending its reach from the current 70 km to distances ranging from 120 to 150 km, or even up to an impressive 500 km. The LRU M270, a French iteration of the MLRS developed in the United States, has served the French Army faithfully since its introduction in the early 1990s. Equipped with guided rockets, it delivers precise and swift firepower mounted on a versatile track chassis. However, as military dynamics evolve, there's a pressing need for a more advanced system capable of striking targets at greater distances while maintaining operational flexibility across diverse terrains. Defense Minister Sebastian Lecornu has emphasized the importance of potentially developing a sovereign solution, although acquiring the American HIMARS remains a viable option. The decision hinges on factors such as development timelines and the comparative advantages offered by the French proposal in a competitive market landscape. The allocation of resources underscores the significance of this endeavor, with the Military Programming Law, LPM, 2024 to 2030 earmarking 600 million euros for the acquisition of 13 long-range artillery systems by 2030, and a total of 26 systems by 2035. The initial steps include committing 124 million euros for the FLPT program in the 2024 fiscal year, with implementation slated to commence in 2025. The innovation partnership launched by the DGA in October 2023 heralds a rigorous selection process. From the notification of research and development contracts to the final competition among selected options, the aim is to identify the most effective solution that aligns with France's strategic objectives. Two formidable tandems have emerged as frontrunners in this race for supremacy. Safran and MBDA have proposed a ground-to-ground -ground adaptation of the modular air-to-ground armament, A2SM, known as Hammer, while Thales and Ariane Group are focusing on advanced command and control elements alongside guidance and navigation systems. Notably, Ariane Group's involvement extends to the development of the munition, which could take the form of a tactical semi-ballistic missile akin to the MGM-140 Atoms utilized by the HIMARS. Beyond the immediate goal of replacing the LRU, this program harbors broader ambitions of endowing the French army with unparalleled long-range strike capabilities. With significant investments and strategic partnerships at play, the journey towards realizing this vision underscores France's commitment to fortifying its defense arsenal for the challenges of tomorrow. That's all for now, see you later.